Hey there folks, this is David on David's Prey. Welcome back to our Let's Play of Psychonauts for the PS2 on PS4. Please be sure to like, share, subscribe, or tweet to my Patreon. Links in the description at the bottom. Alright, so last time we managed to, uh, who, what was it again? Uh, oh yeah, uh, let's see, we made our way through Bila's Dance Party, and we've uncovered that, uh, Oleander is actually the one responsible for, uh, uh, let's see, got the levitation badge, and went back to the tower, found ourselves an insane dentist who was going around stealing everybody's brains, and he's working with Oleander to basically go and recreate the plot of Metal Gear Rising, uh, uh, recreate the plot of Metal Gear Rising by stealing the brains of psychic children and putting them in weapons to take over the world. Oh, uh, yeah, you know, when you start, uh, yeah, uh, uh, damn it, Psychonauts, how dare you inspire Hideo Kojima to go and create Metal Gear Rising? Well... Well, Raz might not be a cyborg ninja, but he's the best he's the best hope that everyone at Whispering Rock's got. And so to that end, we've uh, tracked down uh, Raz's uh, sorta of new girlfriend, Lily, and she got abducted by a giant psychically mutated lungfish. So now we gotta go track that down and uh, find out where he took Lily and hopefully find the dentist. Uh, hopefully find the dentist and Oleander. Right. So let's get to it. Well. All right, time to ring the dinner bell. Yeah. Oh, there's the beastie, and it looks hungry. and no one gets hurt, fish. Man, it's gonna be hard to find a new place to give you lumps. Uh, well, uh, well, you're a resourceful kid. You'll figure it out. I recommend it inside. Like so! Oh yeah, I almost forgot the gypsy curse. And yeah, rides underwater, and yeah, it gets too far, and the gypsy car goes and does its thing. Yep. 
My circus train, don't fail me now. Oh, come on, come on, come on. Ah, uh, thank you. All right, ready for round two? Good, because I am. Crawler, do you have any advice on the current situation? Dodge that garbage it's spitting out. And when it's sucking it back up, bust open one of those nail boxes and see how it likes the taste of those. Uh, it doesn't exactly look like he likes it very well. Nothing more to report. Crap. All right, come on, come on. Hey, I think I see a piece of teriyaki salmon jerky over there in that clam. Why don't you go eat that instead? Oh. Yeah, no, I don't think that's gonna work. Tried to kill me about eight different ways. 
Well, that's not its fault. This was once just a normal-sized lungfish, minding its own business in a mucus-lined air bubble beneath a semi-dry leg bed. But judging by the work done on it, I suspect Maury has mutated it, accelerated its growth, and has placed an implant in its brain to make it do his evil bidding. Oh. Whoa. Poor little thing. See, there you go. Yeah, go inside there and try to smash the implant. Use the psycho portal I saw you steal from Sasha's lab. Oh, uh, yeah. That works on big scary monsters? As a oh, monster schmonster. That thing's more afraid of you than you are of it. Now get in there! Okay, oh fine. Okay, find the cramps, jeez. Alright, pursue and defeat the lungfish. Yeah, just one little thing first. Need myself a little bit of a pick-me-up. Ah, there we go, thank you. All right, so the blue fish are what gives me uh, health. Or not, just... Let me see, where is it? Inside the, uh, yeah, so there's going to be a new mental world inside the lungfish. So just going to save for now, and then we'll uh, tackle it there full fresh so we don't have to stop midway. So until next time, this is David on David's Brain. See you when I see ya. Bye-bye.